Yo, what's up? First shit I ever wrote. It's called Bottoms Up, baby. That's the way we like our drinks. That's the way we like our women. Alrighty, so we have another beautiful bike in here. Take a look at this thing. Isn't it beautiful? This is a 1974 Yamaha RD350. It is a two cylinder, two stroke, two carbs, points ignition. This is one of the last true two stroke street bikes that are around. Uh, this bike is absolutely pristine condition. Uh, it has been sitting for quite a bit. This is another bike out of the gentleman's collection. And uh, we are just gonna do a very thorough tune up in it. And so we're going to do carbs, flush the fuel system, hit up the points with a timing gun, the rear brakes. I found out why they're a little wonky. Uh, I'm just going to do a once around with a, a pen and paper and inspect it, go through and make a list up on the chalkboard and knock the work out. I want to uh, lube all the cables and that is about it. So hopefully this is a one day in, one day out type of job. Um, it is in beautiful shape. I'll take some footage of it right now. Twist your shoulders, pop your knees, bend right over like you drop your keys. Not too sober, but I'm sure you with zombies moving, grooving behind you, grinding. Walk to the bar where they stock tequila. Saw life skin, let my tongue cup feel us. Down a couple shots of the smooth gray goose up. Back to the spot where we grew a little looser. The more we're done, the rum comes, the more fun, the huffing and puffing, the humps don't when the sun comes. I grab my honey and bump some, we under the covers, loving each other like we run until I'm lungs numb. Body's rocking and rolling, I got you woken up swollen, I got the feeling when you leave as soon as this meeting is over, already hit, I ain't talking the game. I see you head up for the cab, you ain't walking the same. Twist your shoulders, bend your knees, drop to the floor, so low, then freeze. Here I come, just wait for me, gotta move and groove and shake that thing. Twist your shoulders, bend your knees, drop to the floor, so low, then freeze. Here I come, just wait for me, gotta move and groove and shake that thing. Big ballers in the club, come the do -si do Young Marty on the scene with the slick. Okay, so not too bad not too bad at all so what we're going to do is we already started on it but we want to lube and adjust all the cables the clutch and throttle and well oil pump that's hooked to the throttle cable assembly uh we need to drain the tank there's a bunch of old fuel in here we can i, I can smell it just whiffing in right now um and we want to flush the tank out clean it all out uh, the petcock petcock is absolutely gummed up. We're trying to get it to absolutely drain right now. Having even trouble with that. Um, the carbs need to go through, clean the carbs, make sure those are all good. Uh, the battery, pulling the battery, going to top it off with acid and then put a fresh charge on it. The rear brake, you you can turn the wheel and you feel it uh, grab at the same point. And I'll explain why. I'll show right now. Um, when we put everything back together well when the rear wheel is pulled i'll hit the rear wheel bearings as well seeing that i'm there when i put it back together adjust the chain um i'm gonna go through and double check all the turn sig damn it i need to do that in so another thing is we need to replace the dash light bulbs um spark plugs and that's about it. We're gonna give it a nice little wash and a little detail, and this bike should be up and going. I got my drink in my hand. Draw my words are getting slurry. I can barely stand. Draw my vision getting blurry. I'm walking wibbly wobbly. 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 Can't you see me? I stay in the bottom of bottles like I'm dreaming a genie. I ask Jack, do you want your flashback? Having flashbacks of taking shots. Targets the hardest. Go ahead and jump the bar set. I mean the bar scene. It's mean. I'm clean Listerine. I need a drink or three. Are you listening? I'm pissed. You're miffed. I just mean I'm pissed. 
just like King, and I am a sight to be seen. All I need is one mic, five beers, and I'm king. I mean, more and I ride me. My punch is like Ali. When I preach, I stand out like Yao Ming. Know what I mean? I'm higher than anything. Walking like a pendulum, my feet still on beat. I mean, my feet still on street. Hungry as a hostage, give me peace. No beef, let's just eat. I got my drink in my hand. My words are getting slurry. I can barely stand. My vision getting blurry. I'm walking wibbly wobbly. I'm walking wibbly wobbly. I'm walking wibbly wobbly. I'm walking wibbly wobbly. I got my wobbly. drink in my hand. My words are getting slurry. I can barely stand. My vision getting blurry. I'm walking wibbly wobbly. I'm walking wibbly wobbly. I'm walking wibbly wobbly. I'm walking wibbly wobbly. Me and Jeremy drank ourselves retarded At the bar with some young things getting carded You wish your name Toots Once As if it really matters I ain't trying to get your number I just want to get you wilded Now we ballin' Got your bank account fallin' Till you Like a something cool We can take this thing to the dance floor Oh, uh, we can do what I want Okay, I uh, took a little break from the RD3 Took a little break from the Yamaha RD350 Beautiful bike But with all older bikes you do run into some problems Here's a major problem that this bike has. Beautiful fuel tank, absolutely. However, all of this is inside the fuel tank. We all know what this is, and if you don't, this is old fuel tank liner that someone put into the fuel tank years ago and did it incorrectly. And now you have a nice mixture of this rusty, I don't even know, like you can just see the shit pouring off of it. And it is all in the tank and then it gums up the carbs and the pet cock and everything like that. Now, that is essentially why the bike came in. The carbs were all gummed up, everything like that. 
So what do you do with the tank? Well, whew, that's a deep question. Now there are professional motorcycle gas tank restoration companies, and that is all they deal in are old tanks like this that need to be saved. Well, I called around and essentially to get the liner removed from this tank and then the inside of the tank treated, you're looking at about $600. Yep, 600 bucks to do it. Now I've removed plenty of rust from tanks and I have a little technique I like to do and it makes it brand new looking. Now this liner is in there. Usually you can kind of grab it when they're coming and it will all just, this one, yes it's coming off but it is adhered in there. So the first thing that we gotta do is get that liner out. Now, it's kind of risky. Why did that liner get placed in there in the beginning. I contacted the owner of this bike and asked him, does he know why? No, he doesn't know why because when he bought the bike, the liner was already in it. So I do believe there were no pinholes in it. I don't think that's why they lined it. I think they just lined it because it was rusty. Now people make the mistake of thinking that they can just put the liner in there and coat everything and their rust problem will go away. This is highly incorrect you are just fucking yourself more by doing so so i did some research acetone will dissolve this old liner so what i'm going to do is get the tank all set up inside of a bin uh, plug everything off and fill it up with that acetone and i'll have to steadily move it so it hits all the surface area and hopefully that will dissolve the fuel tank liner and I'll be able to empty it all out. So I'm going to do that right now. Now that's only stage one. Uh, after I clean it, the liner out, then I have to go through and get all the rust out as well. And then I use some type of acid and that will etch the tank, make it look brand new. Then you got to use a baking soda, soap and water wash and that will neutralize everything. And then I use like usually like transmission oil or something like, or transmission fluid. Uh, to coat everything to so it uh, goes into the pores of the metal so it stops it from rusting as well. So it's a multi-step process, but uh, in the long run, I do believe it will be way better than spending the, around the $600 to get the tank done, which I'm pretty much going to be doing the same thing. <sighs> okay, got some work to do. So, the tank has been soaking with the acetone in it. Now, I didn't show it on camera because it would have been just hours of uh, very boring stuff, but I have rotated it, sloshed it around, everything to get the acetone on all the surfaces. Um, boy, does it work good. As soon as I was pouring that stuff in, you could watch the liner kind of just like dissolve away. This tank is rusty as fuck. I am very nervous about this. I, the, it's for real, the, I can't fuck this up or else the whole tank is fucked and who is liable? Like, this is like one of those things where I don't want to do it. It's really not worth my time to do this with the liability involved with it. In fact, I shouldn't be doing this. Um, so it is time to drain it. I have buckets and everything set up and I'm just going to remove the pet cock and drain that all out. And then after that, I have to rinse it. And then I'll uh, start getting the rust out and then chemical in there to etch the steel, then neutralize it and then coat it with petroleum. <sighs> Telling you, I don't like doing this. This is, if it was some rusty tank getting ready to get painted or whatever, okay, no problem. But beautiful paint on it and the tank is in perfect condition. Like one little fuck up, this guy's fucked. So let's see if I can't fuck up. Give me that, give me that, killing it. 
is Geronimo Started off a frisk, now she's thinking I'm a hoe It's okay, I'm going in for the KO Knock a block, rock stops and socks off Off the chain, I'm trying to get my rocks off Fuck spicy, man, this chicken straight hot sauce Gosh dog, asses like my god Karate Kid, wax on, wax off I start the party like pre-game Sporting like EA, I'm creaming on a muffin like V-Days I master the wordplay and pass it what her say She love the chocolate kiss like her shades It started her worst day Now she glad it's a zip out. she let me hit it the first date She liking it my way When I whisper in her ear, I'm gonna fuck you, baby In and out, in the car, I'm a beast, I'm a star There you are, I'm gonna fuck you, baby In the back, I'm a sack, I'm a pimp, I'm a mac In that ass, I'm gonna fuck you, baby Give me this, give me that, feeling this All booty tat, never get your goodies bad. Look at, look at, look at, yeah, I'm good at that. She asked, Do I like licorice? No. I said, I like licorice. Nice, your figure is nice. I'm digging it. I get the feeling you're getting it. Oh. And in about a dozen minutes, I'm in the back of you hitting it. I'm sorry, honey, I guess I forgot. Sorry. I should have aimed for the stomach instead. I gave you the money shot. Ching. I don't care if I come or not. Sight. The only thing that really matters is that I get your tip running hot. Woo. I tend to book with the devil. The reason you're looking disheveled every time I take it to another level. I push